Welcome to Viet Virtues, the place to learn your Vietnamese. My name is Le Pham. You can call me Cô Lê. Today we are going to do a bilingual story called The Little Goat. Chú Ye Gong to give the character a personality. In Vietnamese, when we talk about a story, we use chú instead of the, like it in English. Chú seems like means uncle, but in the story, it just... It dressed like Mr. Goat, yeah? Okay, so we are going to talk about the little goat. Chú Ye Gong. Ye in Vietnamese is goat and little is Gong. Okay, do you remember the last lesson we learned Gong? It's like we are the little generation. In this story, we call Chú Ye Gong, okay? Now, once upon a time, there was a little goat. Ngày xưa, ngày xưa có chú dê con. The farmer loved him very much. He often said, I love you, my little goat. An yêu dê con nhiều. So he addressed him like a big brother. An yêu in Vietnamese is love. Dê con, little goat. Nhiều means a lot. So the farmer loved the little goat a lot. One day, The little girl accidentally fell into a deep pit. Save me! Go the way! The little girl yelled. So in Vietnamese, save is go. Okay, you can say go. The north accent is q or the south accent is go. Whichever way is easier for you, you can use it. Go the way! So the little girl yelled out. All the families rushed to help. And as much as they tried to do, they couldn't get the little goat out of the pit. And the little goat kept crying, Save me! Go the way! Suddenly, the farmer thought of an idea. Soil! So he pushed more and more soil down onto the, onto the goat. The goat cried and said, No! Why are you putting soil down? Tại sao lại đổ đất xuống? Why are you putting the soil down? The farmer said, I try to save you here. Anh đang cứu dê con nè. I, he, he addressed him like a big brother. Anh, try to save is đang cứu. Okay, he cứu. He tried to cứu the little goat. But the little goat kept crying and crying and couldn't hear the message. You are burying me. Anh chôn em thì có. You are burying me. Anh chôn em thì có. You're not helping me. So in Vietnamese, burying is chôn. But the farmer kept saying, Anh đang cứu em nè. I try to help you here. Then he said, Don't cry. Don't, đừng khóc. More soil coming. Thêm đất nè. The farmer actually trying to tell the goat a secret. More soil is coming. You trying to save me or kill me? The little goat kept crying and couldn't hear the message that the farmer was trying to tell him. So finally, as the farmer kept saying and talking and yelling, the little goat kept crying and crying so loud he couldn't hear anyone else but himself. What to do? Làm sao đây? What to do? Làm sao đây? And he thinks, hang on a second. Let's listen to the farmer. So he stopped crying. And the fa- as he heard, don't cry. Đừng khóc. Don't cry. Đừng khóc. Shake it off. Hãy rũ bỏ nó. Shake it off. Hãy rũ bỏ nó. The farmer said, Oh yeah! Suddenly the goat realized, shake it off, step up, that's it! <gasps> so, shake it off, step up, and that's it! So, shake it off is roll ball, step up, bước lên, that's it, đúng rồi! Roll ball, bước lên, đúng rồi! The goat finally understand, shake it off, roll ball, step up, Bước lên. That's it. Đúng rồi. Shake it off. Rũ bỏ. Step up. Bước lên. That's it. Đúng rồi. So, 
as you can see, the goat moving up and up and up. And finally, he shake it off, robot, step up, bước lên. I am sad. Tôi được cứu rồi. So, tôi in Vietnamese is I. Um, in English, I in English means tôi in Vietnamese. And saved is cú rồi. The cú, okay. So, the moral of the story is, can you guess? We, when we feel things are falling on us, it could be the solution for us. Remember to shake it off, roll ball, and step up, book learn. Things in life happen for us, not to us. So, everybody, whatever things are happening to you, you feel like a burden. It's like, you know, almost burying you. But think again. That could be your very own solution. So stay calm. Stop crying like this little goat. Finally, he stopped crying and he got the message. Shake it off, roll ball, step up, book learn. So let's revise the keywords for today. The little goat is chú yê con. Chú yê con. The little goat is very good. Save me means Cú tôi với. Cú tôi với. Your turn. Very good. Shake it off. Rú bỏ nó. Rú bỏ nó. Your turn. Very good. Last two. Step up. Bước lên. Bước lên. Your turn. And last one. That's it. Đúng rồi. That's correct. That, there's another meaning. Đúng rồi. Very good. Awesome. So, hope you enjoyed the story and I see you in the next video. Remember to subscribe to Viet Virtues to get more stories like this. Take care. Bye.